Hi guys, my name is Mike from Shoe MGK. Um, today I'm gonna show you how to clean suede shoes. These are delicate materials, they're soft, it's a, a leather, but it's really, really delicate. So you can't just use anything to clean this type of shoe. So today I'm gonna show you how to do that using Shoe MGK. No water at all on suede shoes. You just do not want to use water cleaning any type of suede shoe. It's going to dry it out. Just be very mindful to not use any water at all on suede shoes. It's not a good look. Not a good look. So me, is you can use the cleaner and a sponge, or you can use a brush. I prefer a brush afterwards just to bring back the nap of the suede. But to protect it, you're gonna use the water repellent at the end, and I'm gonna show you everything step by step. All right, let's get started, guys. It's gonna be how to clean a suede shoe. Going to use the cleaner and a sponge. After I do this, I'm just gonna use a dry towel and a dry brush. That's it, no water on the suede. So the way how you're gonna clean it is you're gonna put the cleaner right on the sponge, go over the whole shoe. It's a delicate material, so you don't want to, you don't want to scrub it too hard. So the cleaner itself, I just put a little bit on the sponge. It conditions itself, allows it to breathe, puts the natural oil back in the shoe, and also brightens it up. So with suede shoes, you don't want to use any water. You can't use any water at all, so I'm just going to use the cleaner. and a dry sponge. You don't need a lot, very little. You wanna make sure you go like that. That way it works up a nice foam, a nice lather. You just wanna make sure you clean the entire shoe. You don't wanna just clean one spot. You definitely need to be careful of using any kind of water and suede. Water and suede don't mix. You know, like Biggie said, water and suede don't mix. Baby, baby. cleaner itself is going to darken up the suede, it's going to look different for about 24 hours and then when it dries, you're going to dry brush it and that'll bring back the color and the nap of the suede and then we'll get to that later. Um, you don't want to wear them right away, you definitely want to wait 24 hours because you want to let the shoe dry completely. As you can see it's darkened up right now, but in 24 hours it'll be back to the same color. I just use a dry brush and a dry microfiber towel. You just wipe it off, that's all you have to do. You don't have to scrub hard, you don't have to put a lot of elbow grease into the shoe. You just put a little bit on a sponge, rub it evenly and thoroughly throughout the entire shoe. And the best part about it is you'll see the difference. Okay, you want to make sure you dry the shoe thoroughly and evenly. Then after you're finished cleaning the shoe, you want to make sure that you let it dry for 24 hours. Then afterwards, you're going to use a dry brush to bring back the nap, and we'll show you that tomorrow. Hi guys, we've waited 24 hours. Make sure you let the shoes dry completely. Um, it's a soft suede, they're buttery, so you wanna make sure to keep that soft, delicate suede looking good. Use only the best products. Now, when it takes 24 hours to dry, now you can see the huge before and after difference. Me, personally, is the only product I use to clean my shoes. This is a pair of women's shoes that was taken care of very, very well. So it didn't take that long or that much product to get them this clean. And again, my name is Mike. This is what I use to clean them. This is what I use to waterproof them. Shoot them, you can.